bounties. Oh, I'm done. That's just what it reads for bounties. Stuff just goes right through you like you won't believe. So I hope you're not going around giving that stuff away to every bozo you know. What, Skelly? You worry something bad is going to happen if I express a bit of generosity from time to time through our somewhat illicit gift-giving custom around here? No, I'm worried you'll be wasting your time. If you give that stuff away, don't expect to get anything back. Well, not after the first time, anyway. Usually. I'm just saying, don't get your hopes up. 25 is only in hell mode, 20 for anything else. Maybe I just want to show thanks to my friends for its own sake. Gotcha. <laughs> sure. <laughs> sure. You know, it's funny as that's probably true for you, Matt. If you didn't get anything but some special voice lines, you might still do it. I would 100% do it. Mm -hmm. Hey, we can all agree that the aspect of Achilles fucking sucks. Oh, you don't like the Raging Rush? The, the, the backwards spear attack? <laughs> or spear throw or whatever? It's so fucking bad. Like you're throwing yourself at the enemy. I'll buy it just to talk about how bad it is. Look at this. You can send it back or you can go to it. Ugh. <laughs> That's it. I mean, I guess you could use Achilles' spear to move through a room without having to use a dash. If you could find a way of using it as another dash, I think it might be sick. You can do some cool combos, but it makes combat so slow. Yeah. Aspect of Hestia. After you manually reload, your next shot is empowered. Alright, we got spear, sword, or gun. You mean spear, shields, and gun? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Spear, shield, and gun. Mm. This I get extra darkness, which is... I don't want. I mean, you also are on zero for. Yeah. The, for the gun, I think you should go gun. Right, back to work. Let's see. Uh, it's the forced overtime. All foes have bonus attack speed and regular speed. Having to wait for it to land with animations and jump to it and wait for that animation before you can do anything else is just like 1.5 to 2 seconds just wasted. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. This one's fucking hard. Let's see what happens. See that Ooh. Spread fire. Your attack deals for a bit base damage in a short spread, explosive fire, or flurry fry. Flurry fryer. When you take a McDonald's McFlurry and you toss it in the fryer and you get fried ice cream flurried. Let's go with that since I haven't had it. I would normally not take that. I take the explosive or the other one. Yeah. So the flurry is just like an automatic weapon, basically. Well, kinda. yeah, they're all automatic, but this is more like accurate. Hmm. Oh, but I meant like like an automatic weapon. Yeah, the, the other one's also automatic. Like the, the base. Yeah, I'm saying like like a like a machine gun. Yeah. Like an automatic weapon. <laughs> but yeah, I'm saying that the base is also a machine gun. Oh, I see. Oh my god, I misunderstood entirely. I thought you were like, yeah, like like they happen automatically. And I'm like, no, I mean like an automatic weapon. But yeah, okay. Oh, that's kind of nifty. You like, yeah. You can like keep up the pressure, you know. My brothers Hades and Poseidon once fought bravely by my side. You know that, don't you? Give me your attack, motherfucker. Failed against the Titans and established law upon the earth. Your father then descended to the land of death. He was cast out. Oh fuck! Come on, dude. You give me your attack in this bad. You're gonna have to get a couple of palms. You, you think if you get it early enough, you can yeet a boon and then get access to it again? And yep, have it I've done that. Oh, okay. You got the upgrade one. I 
I mean, he's still pretty good. Yeah, with hype. Um, high attack speed or whatever. Is the first strike on your special or is it no? It's, it, no, it's on my regular attack. Yeah. Right, right, yeah. Flirt. Yeah, sorry. That's what the special is. Yeah. It's Should fetch me something. Sold. I, I, I get things mixed up sometimes because like I legit don't play the game. So sometimes it being well, special. Well, sometimes they're also flipped like they're game. named weird. Like special, and then like you have your your special magic is, attack. Yeah, your special is also very similar to what some like you know it's like it's a volley, so it kind of yeah. Are you gonna do the chaos mat? Yeah, I bought it. Going in. I don't want another Poseidon. We just had that. Rather keep my chaos would be fine. They don't feel anything. No. Oh yeah, we know. for their help, but I can't let them know about Mother. She wants to remain hidden from them. In a difficult position to be in, son of Aeneas, even Aeneas may not appreciate the rudeness that I have. Urge you can trust that I shall keep your secret. I wish to see how your predicament plays out. Thanks. I mean, you know, Chaos needs something to look forward to. Am I the only one who, uh, when learning to read and you're know, reading high above my grade level, I would come across words like misled and think that it was misled? And I would say misled to my brain. No. I did that with with uh, disheveled too. I would say disheveled. If you have to say if I'm the only one, then you're not the only one. Am I the only one? Walk across the fire for you. <laughs> uh, Zag. We couldn't see you anymore from here, and now you're back. Well, give another go. Yeah, hey, yeah, do it again. Be shy. Man, it's epic. Oh, he knows yeah. his worth. Bit of a break. Can we just hang out here? Yeah, mom. I, I, I decided I'm just gonna I'm just gonna hang out in the bathhouse. You know, the one that kind of randomly comes up every once in a while. Um, care on, mate. I don't suppose you've given any further thought to my proposal to just, you know, ferry me up to the surface, seeing as it's not out of your way. He said no. I'll take that as a no. The boat is there. Is it always like an like an accessible spot? Uh, only when the they aren't the final shop. I see. I can use this. With. I was hoping um, to get like a tax speed or something. Mm. Hey, Your Highness, anything the matter or just passing through? Happy to get to chat like this of late, of course. Sisyphus, don't take this the wrong way, but why are you helping me? My father stuck you here for an eternity of torment, and even still, you greet me with a smile time after time. <laughs> Come now, Prince said, that's just the way I am. Besides, you're not your father. Z? It's a Z? You, you fucking Canadian. And if you're saying you want out of here, why, I suppose I can relate, is all. Certainly, Highness. Cheers, mate. 
Yeah, probably could have gone darkness there. You think Boldy looks like that because his eyes are where he puts his hands and his nose is where he sticks his head when he pushes him up the thing. You hear me? No, I'm like I'm in a little bit of a hell here. I mean, that's the whole game. Wait, what? You think Boldy looks like that because his eyes are where Sisyphus puts his hands and his nose is where he sticks his head when he goes to push him up the hill? Probably. Or they just wanted to make it look like a smiley face. Nah, there's a reason for everything in this game. Like, Karen always sounds like he's very slowly realizing something. Ah. Uh... Right. I want to invest into a boat of more substantial size if he's to keep up with my work, my kin. I guess brag about ending people's lives. <laughs> it's me or them. Good enough to eat. Pretty strong. Forgot I had that. But yeah, you probably need to. See, no boat. Interesting. Who do we got? Hello, fury Ooh. sisters. Red blood. Fish is my least favorite. Fury Red blood. To Tiffany. Let's go. Let's go, girls. Just get angry. Yeah, make her drunk. He moves out of the way, right, when you go toss it out. Where the hell are you, bitch? Couldn't see her. Yeah. That's that then. My chaos burn switched to a new effect. Yeah, fourteen is like literally like basically the breaking point. Another breaking point right above the, the yeah, line. Usually it's like twelve percent, you're like God damn it, so close. Clear. Didn't really feel like I had that many rooms of combat. Yeah. Love that sulfur smell. Mm -hmm. Where's the fish in? Ah, uh, crustacean. Hey Coulter, have you done all of the little vista parts of the game? Because like every every level has a little bit where you can walk out and look at the uh, the area. You were saying that you just hadn't done the uh, looking out over the horizon part at the end. Kill by your dashy thingy. Well, look at you, cuz rushing to victory after success of victory. Caught wind of your accomplishments down there. Well, then let's keep the streak alive. I've done the third area with Elysium. 
Damn. Didn't know there was one there. Oh yeah, it's in the first room of all the places. Gotta walk up to the side. Spawning something? There's like a little creature in there. No, it's or is that just nuts. a puff of smoke? It looks like a little dude. I don't know why. I just thought it was like a little guy. <laughs> That's funny. I know that toll. I have returned. Fairly caught up with you here, Zag. You must have had a little help from Hermes, I suppose. That was a closer one. A little tighter. King of the Olympians has reached you prior to me, Zacrius. I wonder which of all his many lies he's told you last. Well, she wouldn't care if she wasn't the one. He that was told me to tell you <laughs> to mind your damn business. Dude, I beat you like 36 to something last run, so don't even give me that shit. Oh, that means there's definitely a special interaction if you get all of them and he doesn't get shit. You're very welcome. Now I'd better get back before Lord Hades catches on to this. Sure, why not? Why you? Why you? Gun switched guys multiple times, look kind of funny. <laughs> yeah, oh, fuck. Fuck. I know. Acidel's really tough with these. Guys like to hide. Hey, Who's you're in playing? charge of casting for the Hades movie. Who is playing all the gods and goddesses? Okay. All right, I'm I'm envisioning Brad Pitt as Dionysus. I can see Leonardo DiCaprio playing Hermes. You think so? Yeah, I think he can do like the. I guess to narrow it down, let's start with the Olympians. Yeah. Um, if I get this, then I can't get the Demeter one. Oh, you can't get Ice Wine? Yeah. It's tough. Is my hair sticking up? So, Brad Pitt as Dionysus, Leonardo DiCaprio's Hermes. Um, mind if I join the fray, which is uh, Timothy Oliphant as Ares. Who's that the guy who played agent? Uh, in uh, he played uh, in hit, he, he was oh, the yeah, hitman, yeah. hitman movies. He could pull off the half-shaven look. Recently, there was a burst of violence on the surface. I agree with Brad Pitt, but I think Spider-Man boy would be Hermes. Oh. What's his name? Uh, Tom Holland. Tom Holland. Hey, could you see Timothy Olyphant playing him? Um... I 
take it. Look at these zoos. I feel like uh, Aubrey Plaza could be Artemis. That's who I was. No shit, I was thinking that. She she has the same type of thing because Artemis is like. I mean, I just can't get over the fact that if you even see her naked, she kills you. <laughs> She's so. I'm a virgin. I'm a virgin goddess. You don't fuck with that shit. All right, you're gonna get hurt. <laughs> like no nonsense, but also like kind of chill, in a weird way. Yeah. The big ones are like, who plays Zeus and Poseidon? That's in tough. Hades. And Hades. You gotta get like the right vibe, you know? Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Ready. You could just like pick Ocean's Eleven actors. Alright, so who's George Clooney playing? <laughs> you think Gary Oldman could play Hades? He's dead, isn't he? Gary Oldman? I thought he was dead. I don't think he's dead. Are you anything about that other guy who played like villains and shit? The guy who was in um, Mission Impossible? That guy died. Gary Oldman's not dead. Yeah, he's still alive. Okay. No, I don't think he could play. I don't think so. No, we need someone imposing. Thanos is Hades. Thanos, yeah. Josh Brolin. Mm-hmm. Don't spend it all in one place, mate. I just know that Gary Oldman, he can pull off a lot of different stuff. Pretty well. Ray Liotta as Zeus, Joe Pesci as Poseidon, and Tommy Lee Jones as Hades. Boom. <laughs> what the They're old now, it works. Don't ask too many questions. <laughs> yeah, there there isn't really like a like a movie or anything that uh casts the gods and has the movie be about the gods. Or anything like that, you know? Yeah. Who would be Aphrodite? <laughs> ScarJo? I don't know if she, she has could... the chops to pull off her that specific like type of uh, um, sexiness. It's a certain like living sexuality, you know? Yeah. Helen Mirren. <laughs> <laughs> that could be Demeter. Oh yeah. Enjoy your magma bath. Got some heft. I also feel like Patrick Stewart could play Poseidon. I don't think so. Ah, he needs hair. One of the few that needs hair. Riley Reed. Riley Reed. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't believe so. I mean, he's got chops, but not the acting chops. Could be a water nymph. I 
Honestly, I haven't seen anything that says that she isn't right now. Nice and cool up here. Oh, Coulter. For all his faults, Father did make this place look good. Did we already cast someone for Dionysus? Yeah, Matt said Brad Pitt. Uh, Brad Pitt. Did you have another potential? Play Athena. Some like honorable kind of you know, you know like get stuff done type of Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds playing Athena. <laughs> Brad is more like a, a, a more of a like Poseidon status. Well, I mean, like Brad Pitt has that cool suave thing going on that Dionysus has. Yeah. Where, like, he's cool effortlessly. Right, yeah. And I think Brad Pitt is a little bit... He's funnier. Or not bad, Brad Pitt. Uh, Ryan Reynolds. Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds would be another potential Hermes, too. Yeah. You could just get what's his face who played Aquaman to play Poseidon. <laughs> yeah. What more could I have even done? Could I have swayed you any other way? I can't. With all this. Still I don't know. In I'm picturing him like he's acting in um. Ocean's Eleven. Yeah. Where he's like... Eh. Ocean's Eleven, Brad. Ryan has that quirky, don't give a fuck attitude, though Brad just strikes me as a bit too stuck up. Your father. Ah, that's right. But you're the prince, aren't you? You must see plainly, then, what your birth... Clooney would be good for once. You're no better off than any of us here. Talk about suave. Yeah. I would say Clooney, but Dionysus he's too is, old. Is, is a young god. Yeah. He's, he's he's one of the youngest. Even Brad Pitt is pushing it. In fact, Dionysus initially wasn't a part of Olympus. Oh, not for... Oh, not for Dio. Oh, oh, who? Oh, just for someone? Yeah, I was saying, why not just take the cast of, uh, of Ocean's Eleven and just start putting them in there? Um, yeah, Clooney would be good. Difficult. No, you hurt me with this short one business almost as much as with that axe. Why isn't this <laughs> his short one? For the same height. No, the king is greater. He is the greatest king. By one half seen. inch. What are you? A willful son of the fickle god. I am beneath your father's notice, and you are beneath the king's. Now fight me. I feel like Sean Connery for Zeus because his voice already shakes the heavens. <laughs> yeah, Sean Connery would be good. He also might be a bit old. Well, for Zeus, you know. Yeah, but Zeus also has to look imposing. True. Oh, I forgot that that was mine. I thought I still had the bow and arrow. Oh, which one did you end up grabbing? I didn't even... S what are you even talking about? Like, your call. Oh. 
uh, Aries. Oh, yeah. This is like bombardment. I'm like Blitzkrieg build. Cease fire. Tell Theseus I said hi. Athena. Allie Portman almost feels like she's. Yeah, I could see her being Athena. That's actually not bad. Yeah. Not bad. Especially like, more so now for her. Yeah. She can play that warrior woman, kind of, pretty well. Seeking fire, attack, seeks the nearest foe and deals plus ten percent damage. Targeting system, your foe is targeted by your special move slower. And rocket bomb. Rocket bomb. Thanks, Let's go. Now you have. Now it's. You know, it feels more balanced. You have your lob and your bomb and your rocket. Uh, it has kind of like a cool little like satisfying thing with like shooting the rocket and doing the the flurry. Damn. I want to pay seventy five for this. I have a, like a fine time. I would pay seventy five for this if I had a sword. Hmm. Maybe like a... Yeah. Oh, fuck it. That nap port would be a badass Nyx too. Yeah. Why don't we have a fantasy god league? We each compose a team and let the interwebs decide for us. Drafting for everything now. Uh, draft mode on the actress less actresses. Easy decision. Oh, no. Don't draft like that. You guys are going to take all the good ones. We're over here trying to stream. And you guys over there have all the time in the world and the internet. <laughs> I'm not going to say the, 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 some of the women that just came to mind in my head now. If you're going to be drafting people. <laughs> I'll hold those closer to my chest. Get all the good ones, Fisty, go. Give me icy wine, you cowards. Have you even seen Demeter? Yeah. Oh, okay. I have her special. Oh, okay. Oh, that motherfucker. <laughs> Preempted your move up there.
Got a decent amount of health. Uh, Zach, it's, you're a little bit off to the side there. My method, shut up. <laughs> Come on up. <laughs> Fucking fist kick over here. Uh, Tom Holland, RDJ, JGL, Weird Al, Napport, J Lob, Chris Pratt, Chris Evans, Chris Helmsworth. I just call three Chris's. <laughs> Bruce Willis, Ice Cube, Ice T, <laughs> Dwayne Johnson, and maybe like Seth Rogen and James Franco. God damn it, dude. Luckily, you didn't grab any women. Oh shit. Oh, I got grabbed nap. Natalie Portman. We left you guys Rob Schneider and Christian Stewart. <laughs> God, I, I hate <laughs> Rob Schneider. God damn it. Battle Rage. That Porter is going to do all the female parts. I don't need any other woman. <laughs> <laughs> For this foul demon and his oh, without short notice. Fighting style. A style we shall easily I think maybe Rob now. Schneider peaked at C. I don't think he's ever I don't think he's he's C now. Jump, you coward. Also, I don't think Kristen Stewart is a C tier uh, or a, a C level actor. No, she's definitely her stuff went up. I guess maybe in, in your opinion, right? Like C tier. That's true. Oh, yeah, it's, it's all in the word. She might be C tier, but she's not C list. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gotcha. A true warrior can fight drunk. With the rocket, easily. Not to make Theseus shove it for a bit. No one picked Leo DiCaprio for anything. I am. That was one of Matt's original suggestions. Yeah, I picked so, him for Hermes. Um, it would feel pretty, uh, pretty low to just steal him like that. You know. <laughs> to Too mainstream. Yeah, I think um, Sticks is the only one that doesn't have a, a little light. Look how pretty it is. God's grant me a swift Saint Isaac. Oh, I think you might be right. Yeah. Well, because you have it in the room just beforehand. No, you don't. Oh, Sticks. Oh, I was. Okay. Ice wine. Ice, ice wine. So king of the Olympians, and I. Whom do you now suppose is genuinely ruler of this snow encrusted mountaintop of ours? Oh, ha, 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 Lady Demeter. Your wit 
is just as dry as the earth, so I'm quite fallow in your care. Perhaps you should go tend to that again. Though, lest we go ahead and help our young <laughs> Matthew man first. <laughs> Owen Wilson? Wow. <laughs> Cold fusion. Oh, it's pretty it's good. good. Yeah. Thanks, you two. I just want Matthew McConaughey and Owen Wilson. <laughs> Transfer souls across the river Styx. Not rob you on your journey to the surface, there, nephew. <laughs> Splitting bolts. Oh. Ooh, another Demeter. Do you dare? Yeah, I don't even know if she can give me icy wine now since I took a different duo, but it's not the duo for that, so. Hey. Oh, poor guy was getting all jolted when he was trying to... Right. Seeing what Filter Franco was talking about. Wow. All right, all right, all right. Wow. 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 All right, all right, all right. <laughs> it's a real life combo between them. Just add Will, uh, Woody Harrelson to that uh, that duo. I just feel like he'd be like a nice little glue in the two of them. Mm -hmm. Woody Harrelson, Matthew McConaughey, and Owen Wilson. Have they been in a movie together where they all like co-starred? Probably. You're killing with the secondary hits. Do we have to get crush shot first to get afros or long or other uh, to get afros other long range one? Uh, I th yeah, I think so. Damn. I mean, that's good though. The decay. Oh, he died with the... <laughs> ka <-clack. Worthless. laughs> I love that. Ka <laughs> like you're aimbotting him. <laughs> oh, I love that. The auto-targeting. What? Are I mean, did you mean I to shoot it that direction? Yeah. It looked like you just like shot it off. Somewhere random. I guess you expected that one guy to follow, and he just didn't. Yeah. Could just go right past him. Yeah, he wasn't all the way up. If you don't can see their health, then they're not mm. they're intangible. I knew that wasn't gonna hit me. I wasn't scared at all when I saw it come down. <laughs>
Olympus, I accept this message. Ooh, urge to kill. That's quite a stash there, Charon. I mean, it, this it can't be another thing. Nice. No, I'm good. <laughs> Build is so weird. That was brave to stand there letting that guy run right past you. They don't have contact damage. They have to shoot the big bomb. Oh, really? I didn't know that. So I was like, oh man, he's going to get touched by him and get hit. And you were like, I'm fine. Now back to Cerberus. Not yet. Okay, I'm good. Now for a chat with Cerberus. Didn't I already fish here? I think so. Stonewall. Stonewall. Hmm. You're going to go for the palm? Or, yeah. yeah, I'll get enough money to buy the, the another palm. Yes. You only need 40 gold, right? Yeah. I mean, 12? You only need 12 gold. You have it. Sick. You can leave now, right? <laughs> can I just go back? I got what I wanted. No? Okay. That would be nice. Don't get hit. See me like super dash there for some? Yeah. Would be weird. Whoa. What is that? Is this X? It's like a, like something to do with being against the wall. Yeah, I think that's like a a uh, what the fuck is it called a cummy downy thing? Trap? No, a pillar. Ah, a cummy downy thing. <laughs> I I thought you were talking about the axes coming down. Yeah, but did that look like an axe? So obviously no, it couldn't be that. Right. Why don't you use your brain? Use your words. <laughs> uh, the cummy downy thing seems pretty uh, <laughs> self explanatory. Everybody in chat got it, right, guys? <laughs> right, guys? Oh, he's coming. That was weird. Alright, I'm on the use your words side of this political debate. <laughs> Alright, well. You're dead to me. <laughs> it's fun knowing you, dude. It was a good friendship while it lasted. Cerberus accepts the Sata sack. And out of all the possibilities that was there, one being the pillar, and not the uh, pendulum. Oh, I'm sorry, but pillars are stationary. And you they say come down. They come down. Retractable pillars. They're, no, they fall down. Oh, I see. They come down when you destroy them. 
He's too stupid to even know that. That's why you should vote for me. You still don't understand. We and Matt both suffer from thinking people can infer based on our zero context syndrome. And it, it, you should see them talk to each other. It's hilarious. Matt will say something and then mess up a word or whatever. And so the context is lost and colds are just like... <laughs> <laughs> the other way around sometimes. <laughs> Maybe you uh, just think you're in the wrong. And that you're an obstinate, it's true. a miserable excuse for a husband and father. Don't you understand I'm trying to fix the problems you caused, since you're so unwilling to do it yourself? <sighs> you're right. Whoa, a unwilling. breakthrough. I made my choices in all this. I loved her, yes. I loved her terribly. But now, it seems I'm merely delaying the inevitable. Go then. Go to her. But should harm befall her, I shall bring my worst wrath upon whomever is to blame, including you. Wait, did you want to fight him? What? You're letting me go just like that? You're just afraid of getting struck down again. You're serious. Go. Before I reconsider. Oh, oh. That's cool. I had no idea that this would happen. Did you? No. This is sick. Goodbye, it's good because that was going to be a hard boss fight. <laughs> Here, shit updated. Is all this? Oh, Zagreus, I almost missed you. Truthfully, I hoped that I could make it a surprise. Make what a surprise? My arrival. I'm going to your home, to Cerberus, Nix, your father. You're really, mother? You, you're serious. I am. Now, if you could just help me pack up my remaining things. Only a few loose old oh, no. side bringing, just in case. If we hurry, maybe you could join me. Rather than return the customary way. Not something a mother ever wants to see. Join you? But wait, how are you going to get back? I hadn't thought that far ahead. Just so happens I know somebody who can give us a ride. Charon? Doubtless he has pressing matters to attend to. So let's not keep him waiting any longer, son. Come on, then. The most fucking, like, inviting Charon's ever looked, dude. <sighs> I'm still alive. But how? You're on the River Styx. No longer in the mortal realm entirely. I can't believe that this is happening. I know. My heart is racing. Nothing like a river journey to remind oneself that there's no turning back. Seriously. Though, even after all of this, it's like we only just met. I have so many questions for you still. We'll have plenty of time for them, I think. For now, best we keep quiet. Pretend we're just a couple of dead souls on their final voyage. I just feel like something's gonna happen. Wait, isn't this Orpheus? Snow everywhere.
Well, I think they're both singing. Orpheus and Eurydice. Babies Poseidon, Achilles, Caron, Asterius, and the storyteller. Logan Cunningham, the god. I mean, Caron just takes Zagreus to Mount Doom and meet his mom or whatever. <laughs> Caron, there's a waterfall. Watch out. a mixture between uh, a Samurai and Garfunkel type harmony and uh, Avenge Sevenfold. Yeah. The uh, what one song. He's like fixing his hair and shit. We're here. We're here. This is embarrassing, but I don't know the way to get back in. Except, you know, the customary way. That's quite all right. I do. In the name of Persephone the Queen. Open the gates! That'll do it. I spent many days tending this garden. Or nights? Quite difficult to tell the time. You've unlocked the family secret. But it's held on longer than I would have expected. <gasps> Cerberus? <laughs> Persephone, I... Cerberus, I missed you so. And dutiful as ever, aren't you? I'm sorry. He's got ignored. Know that I am sorry. Hades, you look tired. Though I am not the only one you ought to be apologizing to. It looks I like know. a kid that just got in trouble. I know. <laughs> Olympus, if your mother discovers what happened, not even Zeus, not even he could stop what would transpire here. Oh, I have a thought or two about how we can settle that. 
though I shall need for you and Zagreus to cooperate with me on a solution. Or, if you'd rather, I could just return the way I came. A solution? What, do you intend to have them over for Ambrosia? Not even you can fix a broken family, Persephone. You're right, Hades. I can't. Certainly not by myself. So are you going to help me or what? I would do anything that you would ask of me. Then first, talk to your son. Hmm. Zagreus, you have already <laughs> met Persephone, our queen. I expect for you to show deference to her at all times. Wow, father, you called me by my name. What is this strange sensation that I feel? Perhaps it's this deference of which you speak. Oh, stop it, both of you! Don't Just make like, me God damn it, guys. <laughs> speak honestly with him. About yourself, not me. Go on. Yes, I... Zagreus. I know there have been times when I've let my mood reflect on you. I showed very little patience. Questioned your judgment, often when my own was flawed. Thus, I apologize to you, my son. I have no excuses. And I ask no forgiveness. What about the part where you lied to me about mother? Do you apologize for that? Your foul moods and venting them on me. I've long since come to expect that from you. And I resented you for it. But I always thought you're honest. Your mother did not come here willingly when we originally met. When she left, believing you were stillborn, her decision was final. I believed that she was better off without the lot of us, Olympus included. Deceiving both of you, it tore against my being, but it needed to be done. Well, you didn't need to vent all that inner turmoil onto me throughout my life. Though, I think I understand. I only wish I could have understood sooner. So, uh, what now? I've grown so used to ransacking your domain, I think I'm really going to miss it. <laughs> About that. Your ransacking revealed many flaws in our security. The type that never get into reports. Our reputation rides on there being no escape from here. Would you keep trying to break free? Not for my sake, but for this realm, for the Queen. Zagreus, if you keep fighting out of here, it shall help keep appearances that everything is as it always was. Question, Father. Let's say I accept. When next I reach the surface, is it still going to be you waiting up there? I had the same question. Ah, oh, boy. If you think for an instant that I shall go easier on you because of this, you'll soon learn otherwise. So I just battle to the surface and repeatedly kill my own father then? You have it half correct. <laughs> Perhaps you'll also tend to my little cottage while you're in the area. The garden doesn't take much care at all. I'd like to keep the place in decent shape. In case I cannot suffer this for long. <laughs> well... I guess I'll see what I can do. Just do the best you can. And clearly I've work to do as well. We have a lot of it ahead of us, I'd say. So, shall we get started then? Thus was Hades, feared ruler of the dead, reunited with his long-lost bride, Persephone, the queen. And together with their firstborn son, Prince Zagreus, they would go on to reign eternally beneath the earth in relative harmony. The Queen's return marked an occasion of enthusiastic joy, so much as possible in that dark, gloom-filled realm of the dead. And even after all this time, Olympus never did discover what transpired there in the underworld. After all this time, it's only been a few days, but it's been good. Mother and father were back together, made some new friends, got this fancy painting. Easy. All is well in the underworld.
can't entirely get used to seeing us together like this. Herberus looks so happy. What's hidden under that bit? Yeah, I don't know. I wonder if it's a portrait of him and Persephone. Well, that's awesome. I was sincerely like concerned that something bad was going to happen to prevent her from coming back. You did it, lad. You must have lots of me as well. Or patching up. And I'm to understand that your escape attempts—they are officially approved, isn't that so? That's so indeed, sir. Especially for now, at least. I'm going to keep on fighting to the surface. Helps me to vent a bit, and like Hypno says, it makes the underworld a better place. Though indirectly, I suppose. Well, then I look forward to working with you in a more formal capacity. And it is my sincerest hope that you, your mother, and your father learn to get on better with each other now. Thank you. It's mine as well. Well, well. So between us... All you're attempting to break out of here, over and over. You're now authorized to keep that up? Exposing weaknesses in underworld security, huh? Something like that. I guess I've gotten pretty decent about escaping from a place that's known for being inescapable. Let's me keep in touch with the other side of the family. Work with you from time to time. I have to say, I never thought I'd hear you talking about looking forward to working, Zag. You feeling all right? Spending too much time on the surface, maybe? Oh, I'm feeling fine. I never thought I was much good at anything, but if my fated purpose is to be a master of frustrating father's efforts to make everything strictly perfect, I think I'm okay with that. Well then, I'll be looking well, forward to working with you belt more looks like he's seen shit. <laughs> even if we're still supposed to keep it all under wraps for sake of appearances. See you out there. Bye, Than. Ah, there you are. Um, mother, was it always Insta ambrosia to secretly give nectar to those you care about? <laughs> I guess that also could have been a thing on Olympus. Look, I wanted you to have this. I'm you can so only use your mom's drink from here on out. <laughs> to see what it oh, is. Zagreus, you're so thoughtful, truly. The cool outfit. Father never permitted nectar Such a happy open, skull, too. So I'd practically forgotten its savor. Though, just a moment. I have something for you, too. Oh, mother. Thank um, you. Blossom. Oh, you know that's the reason why she had to stay in in uh, hell. Reacclimating to all this, you said before it was a struggle. Oh, we're gonna. Must be very strange being back, being in darkness all the time. You know, I think it's gone all right so far. Thank you for asking, son. Everyone has been quite welcoming. The darkness is a pleasant change of pace, and while the stress can be a little difficult to move in, I quite like it. That's good to hear. I have to admit I was a little worried you'd be desperate to return to your cottage by now. This place can be a little much. I'm sure it can. And I do miss my little cottage here and there, but... I think I'm through running away. There may be times when it is necessary, of course. But no matter how far you run, it doesn't make your problems go away. You taught me that, you know? I did. But I tried desperately to run away myself. Oh. Indeed. <laughs> you won the paint of Nero, I asked. Well, look yep. at you, boy. Never seen you quite so perky, relatively speaking, of course. Big, tough guy like yourself. You must have missed Mother just as much as she missed you. Well, you've got plenty of time for catching up on things now. <laughs> the monstrous, triple-headed beast of Hades would perhaps be overcome with pure emotion by the joyous circumstances. Were he only capable of this? How dare you, sir? How oh, dare sorry. you, sir? So, I can just head on out there again whenever I want. Don't need to stick to any rigid schedule. Your unpredictability is one of your assets. Our defenses must always be on guard. So, yes, go about your business as you best see fit. And the Olympians are going to keep helping me, thinking I'm trying to get away from you to them. I can't keep this up with them forever, you know. I do. Your mother, the queen, is working on that. Say, Orpheus, I heard what must have been a song of yours. It went something, something in the blood. You know that one? It was amazing, mate. <laughs> that was great. Oh, yeah, that one, yes, I know. I mean, it was a favorite, I was told, by those who listened to the music I created with my muse. 
It was a most productive time back when we were alive. Would you ever sing it again? I highly doubt it, no. Ah. Persephone, the queen. She has returned. I see oh, poor Nyx. Oh, she must feel sidelined. You know? I think her and Ares is going to have a thing. Yes, believe it too. Mm. What happens now? Pick up the pieces and begin again. Together. Let us find out. Should visit the head chef. Sounds good. Such gifts won't stay my whip when next we meet up there. You realize oh. that, right? I realize it. And I hope you never change, Meg. Uh, Aries? <laughs> well, just so I understand. Breaking through everything in your path, taking resources from your father's realm, trying to get through me. All officially part of the job description. I guess that's right. But before you ask, I'm not doing it for him. I didn't think he'd have it in you to leave this place for good. But I didn't think you'd take responsibility for anything either. Anyway, we'll just have to kill each other more officially, I guess. We'll make it official, all right. Deuce is probably cleaning the rafters. <laughs> <laughs> that I can't leave. We'll make it official. Oh, three? Damn. What's up for barter? what I was looking for. The garden's always open now. Oh my god, are we gonna find Oh the garden's open? I ain't never been there before. The garden of Persephone. Don't skip it. Off limits to the prince throughout his life. Now is laid bare to him at last in all its splendor. Not like Mother's cottage, but not bad. That was over this way. Mm. All I'm right, sure other stuff you know, will happen here. Yeah. Right now, it's, you know, it's a little purple. Got to go tell Scully the good news. Yeah, I'm curious about Scully, 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 Scully. Doesn't have anything new to say? Oh, okay. Right then. A little bit of a cold. Your six encounters game plus one. Love Red it. Boon grows. That's actually not that bad. That's pretty good, dude. <laughs> Every six encounter. That's encounters, which which means mm -hmm. each one Six of those rooms, rooms in uh, sticks. No, that doesn't work like that. Damn it! The the whole thing counts as an encounter, doesn't it? Yeah, it's it's. it's it was weird. Only the last room counts, really, unless you have the mom trinkets things from the shop. Then they count. Oh, uh -oh. stupid! That's weird. Well, that was fun. <laughs> Got the first ending. I assume that's the first ending. pretty strong yeah yeah i'm assuming that as you play through more um continues to go with like her solution mm -hmm. which according to lore is that she spends part time in both places which is why we have seasons is uh Demeter gets all upset when she's back in the underground not underworld or whatever i think it counts like shop items hmm. yeah the shop items go down her encounter and sticks but the perfect for the room or whatever is the final room for the butterfly that was good yeah yeah i can't wait to see what the other stuff is and i also love like it's not something you really pay attention much to but all of the uh the design of the characters are so well done for all the the, the people who live in the underworld each one of them has a skull on their belt, and it's a different expression depending on the person you're looking at. Like his is like, like determined, anger kind of, cocky, cocky. Also, his pauldron is uh, Cerberus, while uh, Hades' pauldron looks like uh, the Hydra. It's cool. Alrighty, all right. Well, thanks everyone so much for stopping by, hanging thanks. out, Coulter and Fisty. It was a lot of fun. And we'll see everybody next time. Peace.